Welcome back to another video. As I stated before in the sign-up series, there's gonna be two videos um today, maybe three, but these are all the trucks I've just gotten, and I'm quickly these trucks right here, all the way to like Overcast Max D. Some bad news to Blue Thunder. These are ones I got off the Superstore, all else, which also include the Right Truck Grave Digger and Overcast Toro Loco. So those ones are off the Superstore. The Overcast Max D, the National Nations Grave Digger, the Dragon um, Elemental, and the Pirates Curse. Um, Boneyard are from today at Target. I happen to go there. So this is, I guess, um, an Easter haul, even though it really wasn't at Easter. But hey, also, off topic, a good friend named Washington Diecast gave me a couple trucks. And one of them was the Training Trucks Earthshaker, which is very sweet. My second Training Trucks. So thank you to him for that. He also gave me a couple others, which I might or might not to make a video on. But anyway, nevertheless, let's unbox these. Because these have been in like my, uh, room, my room for a while. Anyway, first... Let's do Blue Thunder. This is from the uh, yeah, the uh, Inverse Grave Digger mix. So, yeah. Alright, this is your standard Blue Thunder. Black roll cage. Um, light blue beads. And the Blue Thunder body is regular. Um, So, I got this because I only had like the Natural Neons one. So, this is good. It's pretty cool. So, yeah. Blue Thunder. That's it. Looks pretty nice. Standard. Great. Up next, Megalodon Nitro Neons. Now this sort this for understandable reasons actually resembles the uh, elementals megalodon, but it is not. It just has a bit a, uh, a blue beads, um, black rims, all blue wheels, a sky blue roll cage. The megalodon body is normal. Looks really good. You know they really use megalodon for a lot of things, so it makes sense to do natural neons. So that's pretty cool. So megalodon natural neons, very very nice. Good to have. Up next, another Natural Neons, we have Zombie. Here's the Natural Neon Zombie. It's pretty much a standard zombie body with a red roll cage and red wheels with gray rims. So it looks really, really nice. Good to have this Natural Neons at long, at long last. Yep. Looks pretty good. These are going to be quick reviews. So, yeah, anyway, that's Natural Neon Zombie. Up next, another Natural Neons finally completing mix 9 is the Natural Neons Jurassic Attack. This is just your standard Jurassic Attack, only with a blue roll cage, blue wheels, and yellow rims. The yellow matching the uh, where it says Jurassic right there. And also on the, um, I don't know what to call that, like the back part of it. Yeah. So yeah, it looks really nice. This is one of the, I guess, better natural neons, you know. It makes sense. I mean, the, the main color of the truck is blue, but only yellow and red, it being the other additional colors. But it looks good. Very nice to have. And an excellent truck. That will be taken part in the next sign up series. Sign series number 44. Alright, up next, we are going to be doing a inverse unboxing, inverse grave digger. Alright, inverse grave digger is pretty much grave digger, but well, it's inverse. Apart from the normal grave digger, you have a, well, you have like a green roll cage, apart from maybe it being black or gray. White wheels, black bead locks. Um, the, the background color is white, the flames are now purple. Um, you can see right here, it's now green, where it usually would be purple. If it forms with the ghost, the purple now replaces the green all right there. On the roof, that is relatively the same. So, every script figure, one of the more better looking trucks, in my opinion. I think this is pretty nice, you know. I like how, like, they really perform this. They just execute this perfectly. So, yeah, Ember's Grave Digger, very nice. Very nice. Up next, Bad News Travels Fast. Now, this is the newest bandage travels fast. Of course, black roll cage, black wheels, gold rims. Interesting on the back, I mean, it says Sign Pro, but also it says Brian Z. Panton Monster Collection. Pretty interesting that that was there. Um, I'm pretty sure everyone else has posted about it, but anyway, well, obviously they have. The truck's been out for a long time. But nevertheless, I finally have it. Let's look at the graphics. It has the delivery boy, you know, on the side, delivering the news and whatnot. In the hood, yeah, really nice. So, bandage travels fast. Done now. Up next, we're going to do overcast El Toro Loco. Pretty much a standard El Toro Loco, only it's overcast. The only real colors you see are just the yellow where it says El Toro Loco, and of course, the flames on the hood. Um, gray beadlocks, a white grayish background with the horns kind of like white at the beginning, and it fades into like a gray into like a bit of a black right there. So yeah, Overcast Toro Loco looks pretty good. I need to get Overcast Dragon as well. I just got Overcast Max D, which is right there. So yeah, Overcast Toro Loco, great, excellent to have. All right, last truck from the um, uh, package that uh, 
Superstore got me is the Ride Truck Grave Digger, my now third Ride Truck. So yeah, this Grave Digger Ride Truck is probably the best out of all of them. You know, it's just a Grave Digger party, though they cut the roof out. You have all the seats right there, pretty much, I think it's like four on either side. It says Grave Digger on the side, they cut out the panels, you know, to show where people are sitting. The chassis is wider, it's a different casting tooling. Um, looks really good. The back right there, where you would enter. And this just looks fantastic, really. So yeah, Grave Digger Ride Truck, looking great. I completed now, I think this is Mix 10. I probably messed that up, no surprise there. But nevertheless, let's continue on with now the target finds I got today. We'll start up with Grave Digger Nitro Neons. Wow, purple wheels. Hmm. Hmm, this looks really similar to a custom a good friend made, but uh, anyway, it's just your standard Grave Digger purple wheels. I mean, that's it. I mean, I can't be more blunt about it. There's nothing else special about it but the wheels. So yeah, I like lots to review. You like the truck, cool man, but uh, that's kind of kind of lame. And nevertheless, let's spice it up a little bit with uh, Boneyard Pirate's Curse. Now this is like your standard Pirate's Curse, only the uh, roll cage is made of bone, or it has like a bone-like texture on it, with the shocks right there. So yeah, the full length bars. Um, the rims are just red, the same color as the bandana over here. So yeah, this is pretty cool. One, I guess one of the better bone yarns that I have. I mean, I only have the Grave Digger one. I have to get the Zombie and Son of a Digger, but uh, this is cool. This is really nice. So yeah, Pirate's Curse, Bone Yard, unboxed. All right, up next we'll do the Overcast Max D. All right, this is your standard Max D with just an Overcast. I mean, it doesn't look too different from the regular one. I mean. I guess there is a little bit of a difference because there's more gray than, I guess, light gray. I mean, the yellow sticks out, so. I mean, yeah, Overcast Max D looks good. Gray. You like gray rims. The body itself is kind of the same. I can kind of see. There's not that much red where there is red. The, the red's gone, so the yellow is the main color that sticks out, so. Yeah, Overcast Max D. Finally, the most favorite truck I want to box is the Elemental Dragon. So this dragon body is obviously like lava like red. The horns are yellow. It's all about flames. That's what it is. The elemental the element is fire. Black rims. The wheels right there has like a flame orange texture to it. Or texture to it. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, looks fantastic. It looks great. This could have been the original um fire dragon in the uh fire versus ice. But it's not. You know. Looks good. Really good even. So yeah, this is the fire dragon. Thank you guys so much for watching. That's all the trucks I have to unbox. I know some of these were likely reviews, but then again, these trucks were, or rather, some of them were already reviewed. And, you know, when I review them, I do it quick. I make it fast. Anyway, nevertheless, comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video for Snapchat number 44. Peace.